Hello everybody and welcome to my Easter weekend vlog. Today is Good Friday and it's about 10 to 7 in the morning and Nick and I are about to catch a tube to Victoria Station and then a bus to <coughs> Oxford. And that's Nick just sneezing. Um, but yeah, we're going to Oxford. I'm really, really excited as some of you may know because I talk about it on this channel quite a lot. In 2010 I worked at a boarding school in Oxford and I lived there for a year. And since 2010 I haven't been back so I'm really looking forward to walking around and seeing the city again um, and we're also having lunch with the house mum that used to live in the boarding house that I also lived and worked in um, and her two children who I haven't seen since I was last there as well so it's going to be a really good day and I'm excited to take you guys with me. made it to Oxford! You can't really see much because we're just in the square that we've got off the bus from. It's not the best of days but I'm very excited anyway. The whole journey here I was pointing out things to Nick saying like this is where we used to get food and like I remember that so yep we're gonna go and have a look around before we meet um, my house mum for lunch and I'm so excited just to be here. It feels, feels like I'm home again. to the Alice in Wonderland shop and of course I had to buy an Alice book but it's in my backpack which I'll show you later and now we have come to Christ Church hold on let me get out of the way there's a tree in the way this is what it looks like this is actually where um, the original Harry Potter dining hall is obviously with CGI and stuff they made it look a lot bigger but this is in here and also a couple of the stairwell scenes have filmed in here so if we go in I will try and find them to show you so I'm back at the Dragon School and everything looks the exact same. Unfortunately since I was last year they've gotten all of these gates so we can't go too far in but I will show you around. So right now we are outside like some of the school buildings so this building right here is where I used to hold the dance class that I ran on Wednesdays. We've come around to the entrance of my house which was Cheryl House but unfortunately there's also a gate here so I can't really show you. We found a way in so this is my house. This is Cheryl House and um, probably just looks like a house to you but yeah I've got some special memories here so it's pretty cool to be back. For those of you who are Tolkien or Lord of the Rings fans this used to be J.R. Tolkien's house. We're home from Oxford now and I had a really really fun day. Um, I thought I might just quickly show you the Alice book that I got. So this is the one that I got. It's part of the 150 year anniversary celebration. So this is what the cover looks like and then on the inside it's just um, like the normal book but there are some, oh if I can do it one handed, there's some really cool coloured illustrations in there as well. So looking forward to reading that. Every time I get a new Alice book I read it. Um, we also took some Polaroids today so this is the first one that's me looking a little bit weird but it's outside Chill House which is um, the boarding house that I was working at and then this is one of Nick and I outside Christchurch. <laughs> Good morning everybody, today is Saturday and we're in a little bit of a rush because we're rushing off to the train station so we can go to Brighton today. We are going with Lucia and Sandra, um, who are both YouTubers, I'll leave a link to their channels down below. Charlie and Mark are also supposed to be coming with us, that's Charlie and her boyfriend, but unfortunately he's not very well so they've stayed behind. So I'm here with Nick and yeah, we're just rushing to the bus to get to the train station. <laughs> So we have made it to Brighton. It's a lot colder than London was actually. I have my hood up because I'm scared of the pigeons or the seagulls. Um, we are just walking to Brighton Pier which is right ahead of us. And I think I'm going to go and check it out. Maybe play some games, go on some rides. Who knows? Got 
some really cool shots because she took her camera on, so I'll link her vlog down below. home now and I am really exhausted. Um, how many steps did we do today? Did you know? We did, Nick has an app on his phone that's like a pedometer. It says that we walked the equivalent of 17.96 kilometers today and yesterday when we were in Oxford we walked the equivalent of like 18 k's so there's been a lot of walking for the last two days. Um, I took my Polaroid camera to Brighton as well so I might just show you the two pictures that I took there seeing as I showed you the ones that I took when I was in Oxford. This is the first one and it is myself, Luthea and Sandra and in the background there is the Brighton Pier. It was a really cloudy day today but I still really like that picture. And then this is the second one that didn't really uh, develop properly but it's myself and Nick and he's on my shoulders and it's outside the um, Brighton boat sheds.